Hi, uh, welcome back to Just Radio. Um, you all uh, should know what this is. I've done a few videos on this. Um, the Albrecht uh, AE2990. Uh, just been a while since I did a video and just wanted to uh, share um, a little bit of information about some new items I purchased um, back in March uh, from uh, Dwayne Maybury. Uh, you've probably uh, seen some of his adverts and seen some uh, listings on the Facebook channel for the Albrecht. Um, but that's the base unit with the, with the battery pack. So the first thing from Dwayne, uh, which is a game changer for this radio in my opinion, uh, is a lithium battery pack. Um, that's it. You can see it's, uh, it's a little bit bigger than the, the stock battery pack, a little bit taller, and it's a little bit, um, a little bit wider. Um, but it does slide on in exactly the same way as the stock battery. Let me, if I can get that on. There we go. Um, so that's how it sits. You can see here the little, the little lip there that's a little bit wider and obviously uh, makes the radio a little bit taller. Now this is the, the small um, battery pack that Dwayne does. It's a small sealed unit. Um, the, the larger unit is, is quite a bit bigger, so um, obviously gives you a lot more capacity. Um, just comes with a charging port. Uh, beauty about these lithium battery packs uh, is this has been sat. I charged it in March. I have not used this radio much since March. Um, and it's just been sat on the shelf. Um, but the battery is still full. Um, beauty of the lithium. Even my uh, Yesu expensive handheld is uh, 10 years plus old now. Uh, old battery tech. You go to use it and it's always flat. You have to charge it every time. Lithium battery packs stay charged at all times. Um, I love it. Uh, I think that's one of the best purchases for this radio. Um, uh, so I would highly recommend the battery pack. So next thing I also picked up from, uh, from Dwayne was the, uh, the amplifier. So 25 watt L25. Um, little, uh, little instruction sheet, just simple PCB layout, bits and pieces. Um, here's the unit. Put that to one side. Again, purpose built for this radio. Um, means it's all self-contained. So we can slide the battery off this time. Now this does require you to uh, move to obviously external power but it just slides on um, antenna connector at the bottom your power on off switch that's the beauty so we'll get this we'll get this hooked up and uh, I'll come back to you in a few minutes and we'll do a, uh, a little uh, output power test with the uh, amplifier all right see you shortly Okay, so we're back. Um, got the uh, the Albrecht just set up on um, UK FM channel 20, so middle of the band. Um, amplifier is off right now, so just going uh, pass through. Uh, I've actually got the camera now set onto the Marconi, um, so we can just see some some results here. So that's it. We're putting out 3.8 watts. Um, they're, they're on 27.791. Okay, so I'm just going to flip the switch, turn the, uh, the amplifier on, and see what we have now. So there we go, 19, 19 and a half uh, watts. That's not too bad, 3.8 in and 19 and a half out. So there you go. It is uh, pretty much working as advertised. Uh, it's quite, it's nice lightweight. Um, that is very good. Um, good if you're uh, maybe gonna use this in the car or um, portable. 
and uh, you're carrying maybe a, an extra uh, battery pack, uh, you know, external battery pack. Very pleased with that. Looks like a nice bit of kit. There you go. Just a quick, uh, quick update with uh, with Dwayne's battery and the L25 uh, amplifier. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll talk to you next time.